Hey guys, it's always Zelp here. Welcome back to the channel. And Apple has released an interesting emergency iOS update for everyone. So for iPhones, iPads, and Apple Watch alike, today Apple has released iOS 16.6.1. Now this software update brings with it two improvements and security patches that of course is recommended for all users to install on their iPhones. And of course, in this video, we're gonna go over what's new with the latest iOS 16.6.1, as well as iPadOS 16.6.1. This update comes about two weeks before we see the official release of iOS 17. So let's go ahead and dive right into this video. So aside from iOS 16.6.1 and iPadOS 16.6.1, Apple has also updated watchOS. So watchOS 9.6.2, is available for the Apple Watch as of right now, and macOS Ventura 13.5.2 is available for the Mac as well. So if you're not testing any betas, this software is available for you to download as of right now. Now, we're not sure if Apple will be releasing a beta 9 for iOS 17, maybe later today or tomorrow, but make sure you stay tuned here to the channel because there's two important issues that Apple is patching right now. So they're not waiting to iOS 17 in the next week and a half or so. They have to patch this right now now that's why it is an emergency update available for everyone and you should update your devices right now so you want to go into your iphone of course you want to go into settings here general software update and ios 16.6.1 should populate for you on your iphone and or ipad and apple watch and mac os as well so you want to make sure you update so let's take a look here at about security content within iOS 16.6.1 and iPadOS. As you see here, there's two issues that Apple is addressing. Image IO, so basically if someone sends you a malicious image, they can actually take control and exploit your device. So of course this can happen through email or message or airdrop. So a maliciously crafted image could actually execute code on your iPhone. You have to make sure that you update just because of this alone. Now the second thing here is the wallet application. So for the wallet here, you see the impact is malicious crafted attachments can actually result in arbitrary code execution on an Apple device and Apple is aware of this issue and this could have been actually been used in the wild so Apple is patching this sooner rather than later of course so there's two important issues here that Apple is looking to address they're not going to wait to iOS 17 so it has to do with wallet and images on your iPhone you want to make sure you update again it is available right now for iPhone iPad Apple Watch and Mac OS and just wanted to update you guys on this really quickly because I think it is important for you to make sure to patch your devices for any security exploits that are available in the general public you want to make sure you patch that as soon as possible thank you for watching guys stay tuned for additional coverage and I'll see you guys on the next one peace